Hello guys namaste welcome back to Android Tricks I recently got my hands on the OnePlus 5T and after playing with it for a day or two I found many tips and tricks which might be useful for anyone who would buy this device so in this video I'll share all the tips tricks and the hidden features of the OnePlus 5T but before starting this video I would like you to please consider subscribing to my channel as I come up with reviews of smartphones along with showcasing the tips and tricks of all the latest devices I also have a series where I showcase the unique Android apps which I am sure you would find interesting. With that being said, let's get started. The first thing which you would like to do is to adjust the home screen to your liking. To change that, you can click and hold on the home screen and press on the settings and then you will see an option of home screen layout where you can change the grid as well as the icon size to your liking. Face unlock on the OnePlus 5T is unimaginably fast. By default it is set to skip the lock screen which is great but it's so fast that you might want to take a moment to watch the time or to see the notification and you can do that by going into settings fingerprint and the face data this will show you the lock screen before unlocking the device and you will have to swipe up even though it has recognized your face OnePlus has been giving the pocket mode feature since the OnePlus 3 which disables accidental clicks when your phone is in your pocket. It is in the settings and in the advanced tab. You will also notice there's an OTG support option which is turned off by default. You can turn that on whenever you want to use the OTG pen drive. OnePlus 5T by default doesn't show the battery percentage and let's just agree that it's essential to have the battery percentage. To enable that you have to go into the settings and status bar here you will find an option to enable the battery percentage as well as to show the internet speed on your status bar another default setting on the OnePlus 5T is the light theme along with the blue accent color which you can change by going into settings and then going into the display there are tons of color which you can use as an accent color for now i'll be using yellow as it goes with the background you can also enable the double tap to wake feature from the gesture settings which might be very useful considering you don't have a fingerprint at the front side other than that other gestures like o for camera v for flashlight m for music etc are still present just like the previous oneplus devices oneplus 5t has a massive screen and no matter how big your hands are it is impossible to reach at the top of the screen to overcome that problem click and hold on the home screen and go into the settings you will see a swipe down feature over there which will bring the notification panel down whenever you swipe down anywhere on the home screen Although I am not a big fan of fingerprints at the back of the phone there are few advantages of it like the fingerprint gestures which you will find in the gesture settings This setting allows you to swipe down on the fingerprint sensor to bring down the notification panel. This is even better than swiping on the home screen as your finger rests at the back of the phone anyways. You can also click a picture by long pressing on the fingerprint sensor. 18 is to 9 is the future of the smartphone displays but there are still few apps which don't support this ratio. To use that app in 16 is to 9 mode which it supports, go to the settings, apps and then click on the full screen app now select the application which you want to use in the 16 is to 9 mode and this will add a bezel or a bar at the top and the bottom of the screen to make it work properly this device also comes with an option to hide the navigation bar to enjoy the full screen of the apps with support 18 is to 9 ratio you can swipe up from the bottom of the screen to bring back the navigation bar and use it whenever needed Just like the previous OnePlus devices, OnePlus 5T also supports the inbuilt app locker. To do this, you need to go into the settings, security, and in there you will have an app lock feature. Just select the apps which you want to lock, and then whenever you click on them, you will either have to enter the PIN which you have for your device, or you can enter the fingerprint which is registered. I would love if also had the face unlock feature which is now supported on the OnePlus 5T. If you are a gamer then the gaming do not disturb mode would be the most used feature by you on this device. It is in the advanced setting which disables all the notification when you are playing a particular game which you have set in the gaming do not disturb mode and you can also answer calls directly on the speaker so that there's no distraction in your game play. 
along with this there are various features like swapping the navigation buttons read mode night mode removing the shelf parallel apps etc which have been on the oneplus devices since a long time if you enjoyed this video you should also see my tips and tricks video on the oneplus 5 which also works on this device that's pretty much for this video guys i hope you enjoyed it if you did make sure to hit that bell icon so that you will be notified whenever i upload such awesome content on youtube See you guys in the next one.